Hey guys, Ricardo here. Welcome to another Blog Tech Tips. In today's tutorial, guys, I'll be showing you how to fix the issue on any Samsung Galaxy S10 where the S10 display has a green tint and of course sometimes you're getting some horizontal lines and the intensity of the problem, problem will vary depending on um, various factors. For example, the problem may be so bad that you cannot see anything except all green and lines or you may be able to make out your background and icons and the intensity varies so let me show you the issue and of course show you of course show you a potential workaround for the problem all right so let's get straight into it to show you what the issue looks like all right first of all you must note that um, I am on um, Android version 11 this is the latest updated version of Android and I'm using um, one UI 3.0 it should apply to older versions as well uh, but if you have the update i advise you go to settings and check for software updates and update all right so um let me show you what the problem looks like um as i said when i was encountering this problem what i realized is that all of a sudden my device is over a year old it's almost two years or so should be around um, one year plus um, if i suddenly one day i simply woke up the device and i noticed it had the issue so for example, if I do this, there you go. As you can see the problem, um, this version is very bad now. Sometimes you can see the background, let me show you again. And of course the intensity will vary. Sometimes the display will go totally blank and there's only a line up here. But most times, as I said guys, the display simply goes out. And of course, you notice it happens at random. But I realized that I had used to have to force restart. So I used to hold um, power and volume down. But of course that took too long. Then I realized if I simply place the device to sleep and woke it back up repeatedly, it would um, come back on, except that was random and wasn't reliable. So I'm gonna show you what I did to reliably fix the um, issue. In other words, how I got some uh, more consistency to solve the problem. So as you see, the problem will not go away. It seems to be a issue with um, the S10 line of phones. It can happen with the S9 and other devices from Samsung as well. And of course, um, as I said, at first I usually simply just wake up the device over and over to try to hopefully it will come back. But of course, as you see, sometimes you're seeing something in the background, sometimes unusable. And of course, it was very unreliable. So I'm um, sorry for the long-winded explanation. I'm just going through what I did in the past and what actually worked. Now, this is the one that I have um, used to solve the issue. All right. So the first thing I noticed um, one of the, um, once was if I allowed the display to um come back on so for example i would leave it to be powered off like this and then i would simply do a sim single top and then i notice once that came up it would turn on reliably then i realized that the solution was with the always on display so this is what i did i went into um settings then i scrolled down i went to display under display i scrolled down again um, if you're not finding the option on yours, you can always search for always on display with search. And I went to always on display, which is the last option down here. And I noticed it was on um, top to show for 10 seconds. So that's what I realized that um, if I allow the display um, to go blank and then slightly top the screen, that was what was um, allowing it to turn on reliably. So what I did was to turn on the feature permanently by saying show always, which is for the always on display. So once I set it to that, I simply um, exited the menu. And once I exited the menu, and of course, what I would do now is never press the power button to allow my device to go to sleep. So I'd allow my device to naturally go to sleep. So I would never use the power button to either put the device to sleep or to wake. So notice the display is fine now. As long as I allow it to sleep naturally, what will happen is that it will always um, be able to turn back on. Notice it's going there. So let me just give us a little bit more time. For, so forgive me again for the long explanation. I just want to be thorough so you understand the problem so um, you can master the device. All right, notice that flicker just now. So the display will always be on. And anytime I need my display, I simply do this. And if you keep on doing that, it will be fine. So never use the sleep wake button or power button to put the device to sleep allow it to naturally go to sleep 
allow the always on display to come on and then unlock each time you need the device that way the problem will not um, occur again however if you use the sleep wake button the problem is going to come back let me show you so if i do this and quickly wake up the device notice the problem comes back so all you gotta do in a case like this when it comes back um, is as i said avoid this button here all right so allow your device to go into sleep state and unlock notice that and allow your device to naturally go to the always on display if you're not using it or automatically lock you can adjust the screen lock time and of course if you keep on doing that guys where you allow the device to simply go into um, the always on state and then to unlock the device it will never go back to the green screen the minute you touch the power button to forcefully or immediately sleep or wait the device the green screen is gonna come back and the lines are gonna come back so again guys I've tested this extensively notice that again the slight flicker notice I can have my device using it normally if I want the device now all I gotta do is just do that and notice the problem will be fixed so this is how I um, ended up fixing the problem for myself or a work around to solve the problem um, the, dev the problem itself seems to be I would guess I want to say her um, software problem seems to be a software bug hopefully Samsung will eventually uh, figure this out and solve the problem I don't know if that gave them any clues as to what I've discovered but hopefully they will solve the problem with a software um, update that will um, deal with the, 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 the issue and we won't have to do this anymore um, otherwise it can be a hardware issue as well so um, it's up to you now um, hopefully this tip will give you time to either buy a new device or of course to work with the phone um, i can get calls i can get messages and i can reliably turn on my device and use it this way i just know that i cannot press the sleep wave button all right guys i hope um that shed some light on the issue it's a really bad issue um, that's affecting a lot of um, devices um, if you are having the problem please relate your situation below um, as always guys carter gardner from Black Tech Tips, we're gonna set a quick tip showing you how to solve a serious problem with the Samsung Galaxy S10 series of phones with your display with the green tint or of course the lines. Alright, Ricardo Gardner saying bye until next time. Love you guys. Bye.